An acclaimed injury specialist was discovered dead on Sunday in his Park Avenue condo with a blade in his middle. 54-year-old drive Dean Lorich was discovered dead lying face up on the lavatory floor by his 11-year-old girl and is the 81st specialist to have kicked the bucket under suspicious conditions. Lorich had a storied vocation, sparing the lives of big names and individuals from both the Knight and FDNY. He treated Bono in 2014 after the U2 frontman was severely harmed in a cycling mischance in Central Park. Agents very quickly affirmed that they are regarding his passing as suicide. For some odd reason Dr. Lorich worked at a similar focus in Manhattan where Dr. Michael Crespo was discovered dead, likewise in a washroom, not as much as a fortnight prior. Fortuitous event? Well-being Not News reports. Police in a split second started regarding the passing as suicide and said the specialist was under some individual anxiety. So that was likely the reason he put a blade through his middle, not his heart, knowing his 11-year-old girl would discover him on the floor, seeping out. Lorich's significant other was out playing tennis when the suicide happened, there was clearly no suicide note found at the scene. So just to recap, a MD the father of three young ladies, relate executive of the orthopedic trauma service at the Hospital for Special Surgery, a teacher at Wheel Cornell Medical College where our 79th specialist, Dr. Crespo, was discovered dead days prior, additionally in a bathroom dash went into the washroom when his significant other was gone and he was separated from everyone else with his youngster, and stuck a blade into his middle. In spite of the fact that about nothing about this is conceivable, almost immediately cops say no injustice, he was focused. After his little girl discovered him she cautioned the building's custodian who called 911. Police said the call was with respect to an ambush, as normally, sources say the concierge, perhaps more quick-witted than the cops, figured he more likely than not been assaulted, not put a blade in his own middle. At the point when the cops found the 54-year-old specialist's body in the washroom around 1 p.m., the blade was not in his heart, but rather close they say. While this exclusive happened this evening, it's as of now been in the news for five hours. How they could even have inspected the body yet in Manhattan boggles my psyche. One of Lorch's indicated associates, who declined to give her name, dropped by and addressed the concierge before tumbling to a knee in petition, this is horrendous, this is awful. I don't trust this. One we experience difficulty trusting it as well. Our hearts go out to his family and companions. Both Lorich and Dr. Crespo were discovered dead inside days of each other in Manhattan, both of Vile Cornell. We won't quit giving an account of every one of these passings until the point that we find solutions that bode well. Once more, both Lorich and Crespo worked at a similar clinic. Lorich, the champ of the 2010 Roger E. Joseph Prize by Hebrew Union College for his compassionate endeavors in treating casualties of the current Haiti quake and in land stool. Germany treating fighters harmed in Iraq and in Afghanistan to the honor perceives people making enduring commitments to the reasons for human rights, who was dearest and an advantage for the restorative group and Crespo, who was investigating growth with the utilization of undifferentiated organisms, have both only kicked the bucket inside days of each other, under suspicious conditions.